Gone on YouTube, it's your boy Curtis 7 Now today lads, I'm here to review our away kits Yes, Manchester United just released their third kit yesterday Now you guys have requested a lot on Twitter How about I review and give my thoughts on the two United away kits That have been released in the last couple of weeks So let's start off lads with the white second away strip Now when it comes to away kits lads, I've got one simple rule and that is to keep it simple. That's all I care about when it comes to an away kit. I hate these away kits made by other clubs. Not mentioning any names, but uh, you know, they're doing way too much work. <laughs> There's way too much going on. It's like they're having an epilepsy fit or something. Honestly, leave it alone, keep it simple. You know, it looks classy when away kits are simple. Now, our away kit this season, lads, are uh, very simple. I like it. You know, but there's you know there's a lot of things that I don't like about this away kit as well. Uh, as you guys probably already know from my uh, home review kit, uh, I'm not a fan of collars whatsoever. Just leave the collars for the business people. You know, have their work shirts in the offices, not on the football kits. Leave them alone. I hate it. Drives me nuts. So we got a black collar on our kit here. I'm not too big of a fan of it whatsoever. One thing I do like about this collar though, if you lift it up on the inside, it's red right round. I think that's a cool little touch as well. So obviously it's a white kit, but for some reason it's got a red Nike tick. And I don't know, it doesn't sit well with me. As you can see, the one I'm wearing, it's a white away kit. Everything's all black. You know, very simple. It's got red edges. Very simple. I like this away kit. That's why I bought it. Very classy. This one here, it's got the red Nike tick. I'm not too big of a fan of that. Now, one thing I am a fan of about this kit is just on the inside of the button here, United have put their little devil emblem in there. And I think that's a classy little touch. Not too many people know about that, but I think that is a really classy touch. And saying that, guys, I'll probably give this away kit probably about 5 out of 10. I'm not a big fan of it. I much prefer this away kit, which was last season's third kit. Talking about our third kit, let's go suss that out. As you can see, it's blue. Now, I'm a fan of the blue away kit. I really like it. Uh, this one here, uh, yeah, I like it. It's not too bad as well. Uh, first thing that grabbed my eyes about this kit was everything was blue and it's like an orange reddish color as well. It's got a bit of a theme to it. As you can see, it's got that stripe from the shoulder all the way down to the bottom of the kit on both sides. That orange and blue, you know, it does mix well together. As you can see, it's that same color on the Nike tick as well. Uh, uh, yeah, no, it, 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 it grabbed me. It got my attention. It got me thinking. But like I said, guys, I'm not a fan of the collars. Stop the collars. It does my head in. Don't know why it's on there. It's what I don't like about the kit the most. In saying that, it's bright blue at the front and it's a darker blue at the back, separated by that orange strip. I think that's a classy touch. I don't mind that. It looks pretty nice as well. But like I said, guys, this, I'm not a fan of the collars, but I can see where they got the inspiration on this kit. If you take a look at last year's home kit and you look at this kit, it's exactly the same design. All that's changed is the colors and obviously the Chevrolet badge at the front. So like the second white away kit, this third kit is very clean, very simple. I like it. I'm not too sure if I'll be getting it. I'm gonna give this one a six out of 10. Bit better than the white kit, I like it. I like the blue theme. I'm not too sure if I'm gonna go grab it. Uh, you know, Nike probably didn't put all their effort into this kit because they know Man United, we are leaving to Adidas next season. Uh, I can't wait to get an Adidas top. Honestly, Adidas do real Mickey tops. I like them. But in saying that, Nike, they do a good job too. Uh, but, you know, the Nike reign is over with Manchester United. But uh, anyways, I've been your boy, Curtis7. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. Get your comments in below. Will you guys be grabbing this away kit or the white one? It'll be interesting to hear what you guys have to say about these away kits. Anyways, I'm your boy, Curtis7. Take care and peace.